Uh, Scott, you were one reception shy of tying the single game record. I don't know if you knew that, but you had 10, record's 11. Um, you just had a great game, 178 yards, 10 receptions. How did you read that defense story? You were able to take advantage of so much. Uh, you know, I thought, you know, the coaches put us in a great position, gave us a great game plan. You know, Coach Evanson's always putting uh, me, all the other receivers, uh, and our quarterback in the position to go out there whenever we pass the ball. And, uh, Make plays. I mean, look at our offense the last few years. I mean, we've been we've been throwing the ball, and it's it's a lot because of him. What is it like to have Coach Edmondson, who's coaching the SEC with LSU and Auburn? What is he like, and what have you learned from him? You know, I've, I've learned a lot. You know, he's he's one of my role models. You know, I look up to him. He's always correcting me, and I think you know he's definitely he's the best coach I've ever been beside. And you know, he he attention to detail. You know, he he's really focused on that. I think a lot of people sometimes disregard that, and that's what separates us from other schools when it comes to our passing game. Charlie mentioned you're really smart. You watch a lot of film. Can you tell me what makes you smart as a, as a guy? Because you always seem to be in the right place at the right time. You're his safety net. What What do you like as a receiver this year, and how have you gotten better and grown? And how has watching film really helped you? Uh, you know, last year, you know, I think I took film for granted sometimes, and I would, I would like, I'd watch it, but I wouldn't really watch it. Yeah. And I think you know, this off season, you know, I had a, a trainer with me. Uh, it was Coach Deche. And he uh, he was always you know telling me like you know when someone's here you have to do this when someone's here you have to do that and I think I, I noticed those I pick up those things on film to help me realize uh, where I need to be and I know when I'm calm there Charlie's gonna be the one. There's so many little things built in this, in this offense whether it's a little bubble for you or an RPO with a slant or something. Just how does that get you going when it, whenever you know they're gonna try and give you the ball? Now? Uh, you know, I think it, I mean, they always call it an extension of the run game, so it's like it's like a big run play. So I mean, uh, you know, if I if I only got six yards on a bubble, that that's a, a six yard run play. That's always good. So I think you know, it's just uh, it, it's just a great way to like get get the blood flowing and to start get the offense down the field.